Hi, everybody. I hope you guys have had a fantastic weekend. And for those of you that have started school in whatever kind of crazy context that is, I hope you've had a fantastic week and you're, you're getting into your groove. And I hope that you're not driving your parents crazy. I know that this year looks significantly different than any other year ever to this point in time. And I realize that there are a lot of challenges for, uh, for you, uh, for your family, uh, for your teachers, and for your school. And I just wanted to make sure that you all knew that Life Church is praying over all of these situations. I just wanted to remind you of that. As a matter of fact, we have a prayer team that is actually praying for you every single week just to usher in the Holy Spirit and to ask God to give guidance, wisdom, and protection and direction as we go through these crazy, um, this, this crazy season in life. Now, school's starting back, and we're getting back into the groove of things when it comes to, to that. But I also want to let you know that our student ministry is about ready to get back into its groove as well. And there's a few things that I need to uh, inform you on. The first thing is this. We have one more summer event that, that is designed to catapult us into the new year. This coming Sunday, August 30th, here on Life Church campus, from 6 o'clock to 7.30, we're going to be doing a glow night here in the student auditorium. It is going to be fantastic. We're going to have some games. We're going to have some grooves. We're going to have some food, and it is for you and your friends. It's going to be an awesome night. This night is a glow night, which means wear as much white as you possibly can because it really pops in the black lights. Now, when it comes to being indoors, we have to follow the, the, the rules, which means we all have to wear a mask. But go ahead and spend some time decorating your mask so it looks awesome when you're here on campus as well. Again, that is August 30th from 6 o'clock to 7.30, Glow Night here on Life Church campus in the Student Auditorium. Remember to wear white, and with your friends, make sure you invite them. It's going to be a fantastic night. And speaking of starting things off, mark your calendars. September 27th, 10 a.m., Student Life is back. We will have our live service on campus starting September 27th. For those of you whose families and you are ready to come back to the, the physical uh, building and be part of the service, September 27th, we will have student ministries live again. Now we have to follow the social distancing and the mask rules and things like that, but at least we're gonna be in some physical proximity with each other. Those services are gonna have praise and worship, we'll have our series message, and we're gonna have reflection groups to see how each other's doing, how, how the, the message kind of um, connects to our lives, and we'll also have a little bit of food during that time. So again, remember, Mark calendars, September 27th, 10 o'clock, during the main service, Student Life is back. There'll be more details as we get closer to the date, but I just wanted to make sure that you all have your calendars marked for that awesome day. Now, along with kicking off some new stuff, we're concluding some stuff. Mainly, our series, What to Do When We Don't Know What to Do. We've been in a series for the past month and a half entitled What to Do When We Don't Know What to Do, and it seems like a pretty relevant topic saying that we're in uncharted territory and uncharted waters when it comes to what's going on in the world right now. But even in those circumstances and situations that we're navigating, there are some things that are still the same. We still have to deal with family. We still have to deal with challenging environments. We still have to deal with ourselves. We have to grow in our faith. And sometimes we just really don't know what we're supposed to do when challenges of emotions, circumstances, culture, situation hits us. So what we've done is we've went back into the Old Testament, to the book of Genesis, and we've taken a look at the life of Joseph. We started from when he was young, and we followed his life all the way until he was older. And we took a look at different phases in his life and how he navigated circumstances, challenges, relationships in a way that honored God. Well, today, we're going to recap that series. 
And we're going to visit the five different points that we touched along the way in this series to give a reminder of what we talked about and give encouragement on how to apply those things to our life as we grow in our faith. So if you're ready at 1045 Sunday morning, go ahead and click on the YouTube link below and join us for our live service of praise and worship and the recap message from uh, the series, What to Do When You Don't Know What to Do. With that, I hope you guys have a fantastic week. Have fun, make wise choices. See you live on YouTube. Toby, out. <laughs>